Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to Angel's Haven. I haven't done a video in a long time. You can see me peeking in the mirror. I don't know that I need that bright light on. I'm not going to focus on myself. I just haven't done a video in a while, and like every homeowner, I've been cleaning and rearranging on my day off from my full-time job. So I thought I'd take a little video and show everybody what the place is looking like. Um, those of you who follow my videos, let's see what happens when we turn the light on. Nothing. <laughs> Uh, those of you who follow my videos know that I've spent a lot of time anguishing over making my day bed look like a couch. I think I would sit on that if I came to your house. I also have this little chair that I got at Secondhand Rose Flea Market. For a while I had that cedar chest sitting up there where the fan is. That fan is sitting on the little stool. But anyway, I moved it. I don't have much house to rearrange, but I rearrange the house once in a while. I took that metal chair that had been sitting here. Right now it's sitting outside on my deck just because I felt like I needed more floor space and I have enough seating without it. Uh, nothing has really changed with the dining area, but I will show you a couple new things. Uh, I have not yet replaced the Nature's Head composting toilet, although I'm going to. I just don't think it's perfect. Actually, I give it a C-. minus. Uh, I'll do a, I did a review on it when I first got it. I'll do another review when I get rid of it and tell you why I got rid of it. But moving on, <laughs> um, I don't think too much is different here, but I do want to show you one thing. I made a little before video, but it didn't come out very well, so unfortunately you'll just have to look at old videos. So this is part of what's new. There's a compartment under my stove that I really hadn't been able to use. So I came up with this idea. And now I can get to everything that I store under there. In fact, uh, I put that basket there. I don't know if I'll keep it there. But I had been looking for my hand mixer, and I didn't realize it was under there. Uh, there's the soup cup that Jenny Taggart gave me, which I use all the time. Uh, I haven't made bread recently, but when I do, I do use uh, my rolling pin uh, for because my hands are not really strong enough to knead. Uh, what you see in that bin, the wooden things, those are actually grape. Uh, you crush grapes with them. I used to have my great grandmother's um, cone, the metal cone that goes with it, but that disintegrated. So anyway, that has made that cupboard much more usable. And I did the same thing over here. I had a little metal cart in here that was pretty much uh, <laughs> junked up and now everything that was in it is here and more things that were sort of crammed in here were are down here these knobs were a couple left over from when I changed the knobs on the cabinets here and those pull out shelves are really pretty amazing uh, Riding loft is the same. I don't need to go up there, but uh, I hadn't done a video in a while, and I just wanted you all to see that Angel's Haven was still doing great, and I'm still doing great, and I hope you all are still doing great. We have a big art fest here tomorrow. 
20 plus artists that are all based in the California Delta will be displaying art. Of course, you know, I have been volunteering for that and I'll be selling t-shirts to raise funds for the Delta Bay Foundation, which is a not-for-profit affiliated with this place where I live. And which gives me a perfect opportunity to tell you, if you don't already know, and there'll be a big email blast going out Sunday, that I will be in Kansas City and I will be having my birthday bash and benefit for Rosebrooks, September 5th, 6 p.m. to 9 p.m. at the upstairs venue at Prospero's on 39th Street in Kansas City. There's a Facebook uh, event so please go on that for updated information and I hope to see everybody in Kansas City at the birthday bash and benefit for Rosebrooks. So thanks for spending a few minutes of my tiny life with me and I will see you next time.